Welcome to Read and Write PDF video. Go into your OneDrive, click on your PDF document, click on Open and Open in Browser. Click on Open with Text Help PDF Reader. You may have to sign in to your Microsoft account again for your PDF Reader extension to open. See at the top of your page your PDF toolbar. To have text read aloud, use the Click to Speak tool. Wild giraffes live only in Africa, south of the Sahara Desert. They eat leaves of trees and bushes. Giraffes have the same number of bones in their necks. When you want to stop it from reading, click on the pause or the stop button. The next icon is the dictionary icon. If you highlight one word, click on the dictionary icon. You can click to have each word read to you. Wild. Adjective. Animals or plants that are not kept by humans are said to be wild. There are wild animals in the forest. Adjective. You can have this read multiple times. Click on the X to exit. The next tool is the picture dictionary. If you select and highlight one word, click on the picture dictionary and it will show you pictures of the selected word. You can also click and highlight one word and click on the play button to hear it. Wild. The next icon is the screenshot reader. It can read text that has not been OCR'd. To use the screenshot reader, drag a box around any of the text and it will read aloud. Wild giraffes live only in Africa, south of the Sahara Desert. They eat leaves of trees and bushes. Capital U. This is the translator tool. It can give you translations for individual words and let you hear it read aloud. Eat. Come in. The highlighters can be used for note taking or research. You will notice you have a blue, purple, yellow, and green highlighter. You can click on one to select 
sentences, or individual words. You can click on the clear highlights to clear some of your highlights. So they are no longer highlighted. Once you have highlighted some text, you can click on the collect highlights button. Click OK. Once you have highlighted the text, you can collect it in a new document using the Collect Highlights button. This document will be saved into your OneDrive. You can also use your highlighters to create a vocabulary list. The vocabulary list will take the highlighted individual words from your PDF document. It will create a separate new document within your OneDrive in a chart format, including definitions, images, and a blank column for notes or example sentences. See below, I highlighted eat, here is our definition. Here is some pictures of the word. And this is our separate column that I can type in. Again, this is a new document saved within your OneDrive account. The PDF Reader also includes several annotation tools perfect for making notes, drawing, or filling out answers to an assignment. The typewriter annotation also allows you to type on top of the PDF. You can use supports here such as your prediction to help you with your spelling, your talk and type tool, so you can verbally speak and it will type for you. You can change the font size and the color of your text. Once you are done, you can click on the check mark. You can also move your annotation wherever you would like to place it. The screen masking tool is great for tracking sentences as you're reading. You can also go into your settings, which is here in your three dots, to make this highlighted line thicker or thinner to fit the appropriate text. The push pin 
annotation is ideal for adding notes to an assignment. Four. Again, you can also use your prediction to help you with spelling and your talk and type feature. You can adjust your font size and your color. If you click on your red dot, you will be able to see your push pin and notation. The free hand and drawing tools let you scribble and draw on your PDF. You can change your line color and your line thickness. The shapes drawing tool lets you create circles, rectangles, and squares. Lines with customized line and fill color as well. So again, you can change your line color here and your fill color here, along with your thickness. If you are collaborating on a PDF, you can leave notes for other people. In the settings menu, at the, at the right hand upper corner, the three dots, you can click in there into your options to customize your speech, your voice reading speed, you can customize your translations to which language you would like to translate it to. Click on save. You can also change your language that it is reading in. And again, just to verify, you can look and change the width of your screen masking here. Then click on save. Thank you for joining me in learning about your read and write PDF toolbar.